Bueno, aquí eh, esta, esta, este vídeo va a ser ir a por el diando, seguir el rastro de diando y vamos a ver qué me encuentro. Una lluvia a ver por dónde cruza cruzo por aquí ¿Dónde? Joder, ¿aquí? Ni idea. Da igual. Ahí hay un pueblo. Me supongo. Estoy aquí. O curso. Correcto. Y puente. Ahí a ver. Menos mal. Es descubierto le deco. Santuario de le deco. Venga, venga. Do you need anything? I'm looking for someone they call Ricky. Jesus, who wouldn't know Hinek? Hinek? That's his real name. I doubt he likes his nickname much. Oh, I don't suppose he would. Where would I find him? Try 
by his folks' house, if you have the nerves for it. The old tanner's a grouchy sod. What can you tell me about this, Kinnett? What can I tell you? No, he's none too popular. No one cares to talk to him. Why not? Well, I'm not the one to gossip, but I heard he keeps bad mm -hmm. company. What's the tanner like, Hinek's father? The less I see of him, the better. He's not exactly sparkling company. Mm -hmm. Why do they call him Riki anyway? Why do you think? Because he's a tanner, of course. Ah. Uh. So why don't people like him? The old tanner's not an easy man, but a son should never let his father down. Pinner does nothing. He's always far too busy with his own affairs, though I wouldn't like to say what those are. And there's no one at all to talk to him. That harlot Adela hangs around with him, of course. Harlot? She works as a bathhouse wench. Same thing. <laughs> Muchas gracias, Mozart. Panadera. Good day to you. So you know this Hinnock. Can you tell me something about him? Not much, Bess. Most of the village folk avoid him like the plague. Why is that? No one with a nose likes spending too much time around the towns. And that Riki keeps bad company. I've never heard a good word said about him. What can you tell me about the old courier? He's as cantankerous as a hog in a thorn bush. He won't talk to anyone. Why do they call him at Riki anyway? He's a tanner, isn't he? If you're ever downwind of them, you'll understand. Tanning isn't a trade for the weak of stomach. True enough. But not every courier gets cursed <laughs> with a name like that. Well, Hennig's nature is no sweeter than his smell. Why has he got such a bad name? Well, like his old man, he doesn't talk much to anyone. And then he's always skulking off somewhere. I heard he got a taste of the pillory in Matai for thieving, and in Neuhoff, he got boozed up in the alehouse with his cronies, and they beat up some merchants. So a bit more than high spirits. Just so. We're all honest folk here, and we've no use for the likes of him. Why has he got such a bad name? I like his old man, he doesn't talk much to anyone. And then he's always skulking off. I don't I don't so a bit more than high spirits. Just so. Don't tell me there's not a single person who talks to him. He's been seen around with one of the bathhouse wenches. Adela, I believe she's called. Fine. Good luck to you. Good day to you. Matt, I'll be with you.
Que por favor la moza de cervecería, una lobareña. Looking for something around here? Where are you? Jesus Christ be praised. Good luck to you. Mother of God, you look like you've been assaulted. I heard you've been seeing Hinek, the Tamil son. So what? Come to preach at me, have you? That I'm a loose woman, a sinner, that I seduce decent men? God, no, nothing like that. It's just that you're the only one in the village who sees Hinek, so I came to ask you about him. I have seen him often enough. I don't know what I could tell you about him. Where can I find him at? I haven't seen him in the village for a few days. He must have run off to the woods again. Does he do that? From time to time. What the hell does he get up to? I, I don't know. He goes to the woods from time to time. That smells fishy to me. What do you mean? There's no law against it, is there? With all the footpaths, looters, humans, and God knows what other vermin around, it's not the sort of thing an honest man would do. But Hinek doesn't have anything to do with those people. Oh, really? Then what does he do there? I don't imagine he's gathering mushrooms. I really yeah, don't know what you want from me. So Hinek is a bit odd, and sometimes he goes off into the woods. So what? When did you last see him? A few days ago. He came to me late in the evening, drunk. And that was unusual? I... I never saw him drink much. He always came to me sober. So he was acting strangely that evening? He was strange. I had the feeling he was afraid of something. He kept prattling on and didn't seem to care about... you know what. So I threw him out and I haven't seen him since. <clears throat> Can you remember anything he said that evening? Oh, oh, I'm not sure. He went on about some fellow called Lubosch who died. That he was regretting he ever got into it, but he never said what it was. And that it wasn't worth it for the money. Aye, and then he was talking about the money. That was very odd. What did he say about the money? Just that he had a pile of it hidden behind his house. I see. What did you say to that? What could I say? He was drunk. He kept saying I was a fine girl and other harlots wouldn't go with him even for money. And if I wanted, I could even take half the money and leave. Or he'd go with me and we could get married and such. Oh, just poppycock. <laughs> did you go there for a look? No, I've got better things to do. Obviously, he made it up. Where would a layabout like him get so much coin? Yes, I understand. Hey. Did he tell you exactly where he hid it? He said he buried it at his father's small holding, in the western corner. All right, thank you.
Is it true? What? Other whores wouldn't go with him even for money. The other bathhouse girls are honest, so I don't know. The truth is, I felt a bit sorry for him. Folk don't like him, but it's only because his old man is a grouch and a tanner. Mm -hmm. I heard they don't like him because he keeps company with villains. True enough. But they didn't like him before that either. Aye. Or me. They're close-minded yokels. Both of us are the black sheep of the village. What? There's nothing more between you? No, nothing. Maybe Hinnick thinks differently, but that's how it goes. Goodbye. Hey, ¿qué? Hay un problema. Are you looking for me? Good God. What happened to your clothes? If you were robbed, you should report it. I'm interested in your uh, services. And what is it you'd like? bit of everything. Heal my wounds, have a proper bath. Oh, and my garments are in need of laundering. As you wish. Do you have the coin? Uh, coin. Here it is. I'm sure you'll be extremely satisfied. Goodbye. Hey, is someone there? <laughs> I'll be with you. What's happening around here? Ah, you know how it is. Always something. Like that sake, it started an archery contest here. If you want to try your luck at winning a few brushing, you should go and see him. And there's more. Especially at the mill. Not a week goes by without some ruckus there. But I'm wise to them troublemakers. Whenever they're planning some mischief, they're always huddled there in the corner, hatching their plots. Like yesterday, for instance. Mm, and yes, whore... Now I think of it. I've not seen Kunhuta here for some time. The local herb woman. She always comes here once a week for a tankard of ale. But she ain't turned up recently. I hope nothing's happened to her. Bye. I'll be with you. Okay. 
prepare the new sphere. Almeida. God be with you. What can I do for you? May the Lord watch over you. Allí. No, ese es para el arquero. El campo de tiro con arco. Jesus Christ, be praised. Take care, man. Oh, oh. El curtidor tiene que estar cerca. Aquí está. Jesus Christ be praised. I'm looking for your son. Any idea where he might be? I don't know nothing. Don't you at least know where he usually goes? It's important. He next shows up at home once in a blue moon, so I don't know nothing about where he gets to. Even if I did, why would I tell every Tom, Dick and Harry? I'm a soldado. Watch your tongue, peasant. I'm an envoy of Sir Radza Kabila, and this is an official investigation. Stop trying to put me off and tell me where your son is right now. I apologise if I offended you, young man. But still, I don't know where he neck is. He turned up at the house a while back, but then he vanished again in a hurry. And you don't know where he went? Uh, what? <sighs> Look. It's been clear to me for a long time that my boy was headed for the gallows. But I'm still his father, right? And you can't expect me to rat on my own son. If you value your son's life at all, you better pray I find him. Because I'm not the only one looking for him. That's no surprise. But what of it? If you're here on behalf of Sir Radzik, there's nothing waiting for Hinnick but the gibbet. It doesn't have to be that way. If Hinnett cooperates, he can save his neck. I can't say you put my mind at ease. But to hell with it. I'll tell you what I know. All right. He was here a few days ago, but he left right away. He looked like... like he was in a hurry. And you don't know where he went? I've got an idea, but I don't know where it is exactly. I don't follow. Hinnett makes some money on the side from poaching. He boasted to me a few times about what a great hideout he found in the woods. But he never told me where it is. Well, it's not much to go on. But it's better than nothing. Thank you. Don't you have any clue at all where his hideout could be? I really don't know nothing about that. I could tell when he'd come from there is all. How's that? 
because every time he brought some hides for tanning and money. What more do you know? Nothing! I swear to God Almighty, I've said all I know. Hinnick never told me nothing. Bloody hell. Start using your head or I'll never find Hinnick. How much time did he spend away? What was he wearing? How did he look when he came back? Anything? Well, he came and went at all sorts of hours. I really don't know. Uh, except maybe one thing. He'd come home scratched with brambles and with leaves and muck on him. So he probably went through thick woods to get to that place. I reckon. What do I know? He had money because he sold the stuff right away. I suppose. He never kept any of his loot here. Do you know who he sold it to? No. But the innkeeper came here now and again and gave him a coin. Of course, it could have been for me. All right. I'll ask at the inn then. Don't you have any clue at all where his hideout could be? I really don't know nothing about that. I could tell when he'd come from there is all. How's that? Because every time he brought some hides for tanning and money. I'd like to talk to you about your Hinnock. I'm very busy, so make it quick. Do you at least know any friends he's with or someone he goes to see? As far as I know, nobody here in the village talks to him. I heard he's seeing some bathhouse wench. Maybe. He can't get it for free, so I suppose he has to go to the baths. Go. And if he's really in as much shit as you say. ¿Qué pasa? Estoy buscando el maldito escondite de tu hijo. Seguir el resto de vianda en el día del proceso de carne que hacer ir a comprobarlo y buscar la cerveza, buscar la reserva de vianda. Estoy aquí. A ver dónde coño lo puse. Hostia, aquí. Oh. Mother of God. Cállate. Cállate. Jesus, I see a thief. God, come here quick. There's a thief over there. I see a thief! Guard! Guard! Come here quick! There's a thief over there! Somebody help! Nike. Damn it! Alarm! Come here quick! Mierda! <laughs>
Hey, you! Stop! Hear me! So it's you. You were seen starting a brawl. What's that? This definitely won't come cheap. You'll learn crime doesn't pay. Hmm. This is surely no way to treat one of Sir Radzig's men. I dread to think what he'll do when he finds out. Try your fairy tales on someone else. I can't pay that. Well, it's a jail cell for you then. Jail? Alright, let's go and get it over with quick. Get moving. I hope you rot there. Give me all the things you stole so I can return them to their rightful owners. Joder, seis días en la cárcel. Mi madre. <risa> Queda menos. Bueno, ya una hora, a ver cómo sale este día. Todo de macrado, todo hecho polvo. Haber perdido dinero. Ay, lo tenía que haber hecho por el día. Lo tenía que haber hecho por el día. ¿Qué día por el, por el día, digo? Por la noche. Mira, con lista, ala. Que me que he perdido. No me quita, no. Esto, el gambeo el dinero no me lo quitaron hostia que estoy en rata
Bien, Job done for you then. Don't even remind me. Jesus Christ be praised. May the Lord watch over you. I'll have to get something to eat. I'm starting to get hungry. <laughs> <laughs> 